In 2023, we had 79 returned transformers from customers indicating that their brand new transformers did not work. It's actually a very small number compared to the over 4,120 we sold. In addition, out of the 79 returned, only two were defective, about 0.04% defective. And we think those two transformers were actually put in backwards. Is it possible that you have a defective transformer? Yes, it is, but not very likely. In this longer video, we were asked by our customers to do a little more explanation. So I'm going to do that today for you. So let's start at the beginning. These three transformers were returned to us this week. Customers were very adamant that these three were defective right out of the box. They said that they tested them and that's what they found. So we issued a return label and they sent the transformers back here where we test them. And this is pretty much how we do it. And I'll tell you why. So let's go over a couple of things. All of these transformers here are 120 volt input, and that's because that's what I have here in the studio. We do offer the transformers in higher um, voltages for input, uh, but that's what we have here in front of us. They're all dimmable, of course. So coming into the transformer is 120 volts. These wire nuts attach it directly to this transformer. And I wanna note that anytime you have a wire nut, you have a possibility of not having a good connection. Therefore, your circuit will fail. So the wire nuts need to be done correctly. They need to be tight, and we need to make sure that the power is flowing into the transformer. From the transformer, the 12 volts goes out, again, wire nuts, into a socket. And I have the socket right here. And this is uh, replicated here on all three transformers to give you an idea of what we have. It's really, really simple. This is a great test because none of your voltage meters, most likely, are capable of taking a voltage reading at this point. Because these are LED transformer, you can't use a standard voltage meter to test. You can on this side at the 120 volt side, but on the 12 volt or the 24 volt side, you can't. You need a true RMS multimeter. And they range from about $700 up. So not too many people own those. But I think that our test is quicker, easier, and more effective in some ways, unless you're an engineer. So again, just quickly, 120 volts in, 12 volts out to a socket. So let's see if these three transformers that were returned to us are actually defective. So I'm gonna just take a 12 volt light bulb, this is an LED bulb, and I'm gonna put it in each socket. And as you can see, all the light bulbs light up. So we know that the problem isn't the transformer, but it really could be somewhere else in the circuit. Now, LED transformers are dimmable. So the voltage coming in, which is varied by your dimmer, affects the voltage going out to the bulb. That's how this gets dimmed. So you may have a brand new LED bulb. You may have your brand new transformer but going back to your dimmer, you may not have a dimmer that's made for LED lighting. Now, a lot of the old halogen dimmers that are out there on people's wall will work, but not all of them. It's really best to have an ELV dimmer, one of the more modern dimmers that are made for LED bulbs. And the reason is, is the LED dimmer has electronics built for an electronic LED transformer and an electronic LED bulb. If you remember, the old halogen bulbs are really just an old school light bulb with a filament in it and halogen gas. There's no electronics. It's just a burning filament. Anyway, we thought this might help give you a clarification of how we kind of get things tested. And we have a very detailed email that we'd be very happy to send you with kind of a checklist of things that you can check on your lighting circuit to find out where the real culprit is of your lighting circuit not working. You really don't want to buy a brand new transformer if that's not really the problem. Problem actually might be a wire nut. Thanks for watching. I hope this helped some. Have a great day. And if you need us, we'll be here. Please feel free to email us direct at support at totallightingsupply.com. It is by far the best way to communicate with us and get a quick response. Also, see the video description for links to our products, resource pages, and contact form. Thank you for watching. We hope to hear from you soon.